Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today let's talk about PlayStation 3 emulation. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to install PS3 emulator on your Steam Deck, Steam OS, all right? And I'm going to show you how to set it up, configure it, so you can play your favorite PS3 games, such as God of War 3, Virtual Tennis 4, um, Fight Night Champion, stuff like that, all right? So without further ado, let's just get started. Okay, so I'm on my Steam Deck desktop mode, Open up a browser, go to mudeck.com, all right? And there's a download up top, so click on it. Click on the Steam OS, okay. And then you should download a file called mudeck.desktop. All right, locate that, it should be in your downloads folder. Double click it, execute, continue. And you should see this console load up and you're downloading something, all right? So it'll download and install MUDEC. All right, so just be patient here. Okay, so while we're at it, please go over to my secondary channel. I just created a channel about cooking. So it's called Grown Up Cooking. And currently only has eight subscribers. I haven't really uploaded any cooking videos yet. I'm planning on it. All right, I've only just got an intro video. All right, so yeah, please go over there and support me. All right, I'm going to upload some cooking videos that's another passion of mine other than gaming all right so okay so emutech is still downloading so while we're doing that go over to this website playstation.com i'll also leave a link in the description we need to download the ps3 firmware file all right currently the version is 4.90 as of recording so go over here and then uh, click this one, update using a computer, and then click this blue button, download PS3 update. And it might like say there's a security risk, so I trust it. It's from PlayStation.com. So allow download. All right, and this is the PlayStation 3 firmware, which is needed when we, like after we installed the emulator, you need this to run the games. Okay. So yeah, Emutech is still downloading. I think there's something wrong with my internet might be a little bit slow but uh, yeah if you like this kind of stuff if you like gaming handhelds especially the steam deck we talk a lot about emulation something like this a video like this all right and we also talk a lot about mods cheats trainers such as we mod we how to install we mod on your steam deck all right and we also install windows games onto your steam deck steam os all right so if that is your thing that's basically all we talk about so please subscribe to this channel and click that little bell button. All right. And also like this video. Thank you guys. All right. So yeah, let's just wait for this to finish downloading and install. Okay. So now we finished downloading. It's going to welcome to Emu Deck and it's got to ask us to do some settings. Okay. So I think it's still downloading files okay so i'll suggest just go to easy mode all right select easy mode continue and then i normally put it on my sd card all right so you could also put it onto your internal storage if you don't have an sd card i guess but i like to put all my emulation stuff on the sd card so i'm going to select sd card next and then select steam deck finish all right and it's going to just um download all these emulators all right so it'll take some time i'm going to fast forward this part so i'll see you back when it's done okay so that took like forever but yeah now we're done okay click add games all right you could if you have some roms on your like thumbstick or something you can install it here but i'm not going to do it for now so skip for now okay so we're basically done installing you can do some customization here okay so now we can go into like all applications and locate your ps3 emulator it's called rpcs3 so i'm going to load it up here okay so once you're in this screen the first thing you want to do is install the firmware so go to file and then install firmware 
Okay, and then I'm going to go to my downloads. So if you remember, I downloaded the PS3 firmware. So PS3 up that dot PUP. Double click it. All right, it's installing. And yeah, that should be almost done. Okay, now it's booting up into this installer thing. All right, so let it install. Takes around like a minute. All right, let me fast forward this part as well. Okay, so our firmware is finished installing. Okay, and now we need to put our ROMs. All right, so where you put it, so since I put my um, MU deck, I installed it onto my SD card. So I'll go here to my SD card, and then there's a folder called emulation, and then ROMs. All right, and then there's a folder called PS3. So let me find it. All right, here, PS3. So I put my ROMs here. Okay. So you should put them like normally when I dump my ROMs, I think there's two versions. One version is called encrypted and one is decrypted. I normally do them decrypted. All right. So this is my decrypted ROM. Okay. So I'm just going to put this Fight Night Champion. I'm going to copy it. And I'm going to put it into the PS3 folder. All right. So let it copy. All right. I also have like if you have. And like sometimes you probably dump them as ROMs, uh, not ROMs, as ISO format because they're, they're disks. All right. So I've got here Skate 3. It's an ISO. Okay. So I've mounted it over here. It, like you just probably, it's the format is the same, but like you probably have to um, extract it to a folder instead of an ISO format. All right. So yeah, let's just wait for my game to transfer over to my emulation roms ps3 folder all right so yeah and then we might have to refresh our emulator once it's done so you can see my game i also have some dlcs and update all right so I might have to install that later. I just, I'm just going to copy it all over to my ROMs page right now. Almost done. Okay, so it's done. All right, now I'm going to refresh it. All right, now you can see. All right, you can see Fight Night Champion is here and it's currently at version 1.00, okay? So what I normally do is I go, I right click, okay? And then I go to um, check game compatibility. So I'll load up a website to tell you whether this game is playable or not. So you can see Fight Night Champion, it's in game, okay? So it does have some glitches and some performance issues. So normally I click on the name of the game and it'll boot into like the details for this game. And normally it would have some configurations, okay? So it says, okay, options that deviate from the default settings, okay? So you can also click here to the default settings and see like it should be when you first install your emulator. So you go to configuration, see all this. All right, I think we should move it around. Okay, you can see here, PPU decoder, all right, LLVM. Yeah, I think it's standard. So if you like adjusted this, um, you could just click restore default and it should be same as this, all right? And on the website for your game, normally it would show you the recommended settings, all right? So just follow along. Like it might ask you to change something here or there. I think one of the uh, most common one I see is the GPU, uh, right color buffer, stuff like this. Like it'll tell you here in this page, all right? But this game doesn't have it. This one only tells you that it has recommended patches, all right? So if you want to get the best performance for this game, you need to download patches. So how do you do that? All right, let's not go to configurations. So this game just runs on normal default configurations. And then just right click the game. And then here, uh, manage game patches, okay? 
And then it says new patches available. All right, so we want to update that. Okay, so then Fight Night Champion. All right. So it's recommended that you go to 1.02. And we do the unlock FPS. Okay. So I think we should use the unlock FPS. Let me see again. Um, here it says... Yeah, recommended patch, unlock FPS. So that's the one I want. And it works for the latest update, 1.02. So let me just apply and save first. My game is currently at 1.00. So that patch won't work. So I need to update. So I'm going to go to file. Okay, install packages. Wraps, eat that. Okay, click this one. And then locate my game. So on my... SD card, emulation, ROMs, PS3, Fight Night Champion. And you can see here, I've got the patch update 1.02. All right, click this. Yeah, let it update. Okay, we don't need to add the shortcuts. All right, so now you can see that the game is 1.02 version. And I've got the like patch on. All right, so it should work. All right, let's... Uh, Let's quit the emulator. And because we installed EmuDeck, all right, there's another program that lets you create a shortcut on your Steam library. So you can play this on your gaming mode. So that's called um, here, Steam ROM Manager. All right. So open this and you have to select yes because it needs to close your Steam. Because um, it closes your Steam and then once you add your um shortcuts you can add it to steam when steam is open it can't do that all right so here you need to select your passes okay i'm just going to turn them all off all right because i just want the sony playstation 3 one all right i don't want the others so this goes into your roms directory and looks for whatever roms you have and then it adds them to your shortcut on steam so here playstation three all right so i want this playstation 3 rpcs3 extracted iso right i don't think i want this this installed package this like if you install the packages because mine's not mine's extracted iso so i'm just going to do this and then click preview then you click pass Okay, and then it should it found it. See here, Fight Night Champion. Uh, and then you click here, save to Steam. All right, make sure you click this, else it's not going to save it. All right, so save to Steam. And then on the top right here, it's done when it says done adding. All right, so make sure you wait for that. And I'm going to close it and I'm going to return to gaming mode and try it out. Okay, so let me get my Steam Deck so I can use the controller. Oops. I think I messed up the light. Okay. Lights back on. So yeah, let's just wait for my theme deck to boot up. Okay. Click on the Steam button. Go to Library. Alright. Collections. Alright, PlayStation 3. You can see Fight Night Champion. It's already installed here. Alright, let's click Play and see if it works. Okay, so we're booting up the game. And because this is the first time we're loading the game, I think it's going to like load the cache, the shaders and all that. So it's going to take some time. All right, yeah, it's going to take like 16 minutes. All right, now it's dropped to five. All right, so I'll fast forward this part. Okay, so I think all the cache is loaded. E now it's compiling shaders. Okay. So the game does run, but I don't think it's the best because I played it before. It's not the best. I think we need to do more settings. So uh, not all games run perfectly on PlayStation 3 emulation. I think you've got to know that. Like we're just not there yet. All right. So um, my recommendation is go to the check compatibility, uh, right click it on your emulator and go to the website and follow the settings there. And if that works, that's great. If it doesn't, you might need to tweak it. 
so yeah the game works so yeah i'll leave it here um i might do a follow-up video and tweak this game to make this game run better all right and yeah if you like this video please leave a like and subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one Later.